Now at 10, our Samantha German is getting some reaction to this report that came out late today. Samantha. Matt, thousands of people use I-81 every day through downtown Syracuse. And if you take a look behind me, big changes are about to be made very soon. All of this will look completely different in just a few years. The lengthy list of 17 alterations has now been narrowed down to only three. And some drivers who we spoke with say right now, they don't think the interstate is safe at all. A lot of the exits and entrances are pretty challenging to people. Um, parents coming for graduation at Syracuse, it's really hard to give directions to people. Um, and you have to worry about the safety with the amount of snow that we have in the winter. I asked the commissioner specifically uh, uh, whether the tunnel and the boulevard ideas would be mutually exclusive because there's many, many people in this district that believe that if you want to get off uh, on a boulevard and go somewhere in Syracuse, God bless you. One of the big developments from the state DOT is keeping the idea of a tunnel alive. And members of Save 81 are definitely on board. I think it's great that the tunnel's still an option. That, that really means that they're listing. Um, a lot of people were in favor of that, and I think it's something that certainly needs to be explored as this, uh, this process goes further. But then there are others who believe the interstate is just fine the way it is. I personally think they should leave it the way it is. I drive back and forth from Ithaca, New York to here in Syracuse every day, and it's very efficient, and I, I really like how it is right now. Now, the report is 250 page long, and it includes a lot of detail about the three options, including new ways the interstate highways in and around Syracuse could be numbered and the improved connections between 690 and 81 through the downtown interchange. For now, reporting live in Syracuse, I'm Samantha German. Thank you, Samantha. We have a link to that report on our website, cnycentral.com.